welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing something not makeup related, but it's hair related, and I am obsessed with like just hair in general. I used to buy so many products when I was younger because I have very thick, very frizzy, coarse, dry, pretty much everything under the sun type of hair. And I used to spend so much money on products, like testing everything out, trying all these new things, and I came across some good products that really do my hair some justice. So I'm gonna go over today a little bit of everything. I'm gonna go over what I use in the shower. So what I, like my shampoo, my conditioner. I'm gonna go over the products that I put into my hair afterwards if I'm planning to wear it curly versus straight. And then I'm gonna go over what I use to style. And then my all time top tools for thick, coarse, frizzy, dry, like, hair in general and I apologize if I sound really nasally because I got really sick in the past couple days I don't know what I had but I had just had a book so I'm sipping tea and I sound a little nasally but by the next video hopefully it goes away so we have a lot to go through so let me get started first things first shampooing my hair I wash my hair once a week oh I know that sounds kind of gross if I'm working out a lot and my hair gets like you know a little gnarly from sweat then yeah of course I'll wash it a little bit more but in general I wash my hair about once a week maybe twice a week and I love to use um, the matrix Biolage, I'm gonna say that one, Biolage, I'm gonna say, Deep Smoothing Shampoo. This is paraben free, um, and I picked mine up at CVS. You can get this at a really good price if you're shopping at BJ's, Costco has it. Um, I think stores like that will have it for a really good price, but I picked mine up at CVS because I was uh, really desperate. But this is a really good shampoo um, for color treated hair and just smoothing out your hair in general. Shampoo, you can kind of, I mean, you don't have to spend a lot of money on shampoo. You really don't. Shampoo is shampoo. It's just going to wash your hair. I'm a big fan of head and shoulders, and I use that a lot just because I feel like it gets all the products and all the grease out of my hair. Like, you don't have to spend a lot of money on shampoo, but that's the one I've been using lately. What I do spend a lot of money on is my conditioner. So, for conditioner, I've been using my Shea Moisture Raw uh, Shea Butter Restorative Conditioner with Sea Kelp and Art Argan Oil for dry and damaged hair. This helps grow and strengthen uh, your hair is sulfate free and color safe. I'm a big fan of, um, it's a little wet. I'm a big fan of Shea Moisture products in general. They have an amazing, um, eczema, like, bar of soap that I use. I don't have eczema, but I do have, like, Keratosis Polaris. I don't know if many people know what that is, but it's just, like, those little dots that you get on your arms. So I use a lot of Shea Moisture products for that because they're all natural. They're no sulfates, no parabens, no phthalates. I don't know. No paraffin, no gluten, no gla I mean, I can't even say half this stuff. No mineral oil, no synthetic color, no DEA, no animal testing. Don't hurt them animals. And no synthetic fragrance, which is something that I really like. And it smells amazing and it's really, really good for your hair. So the next thing that I recently picked up that I've been loving is my Chi um, Keratin Conditioner. This is a restruct uh, reconstructing conditioner and it smells amazing. I use a lot of a lot of conditioner when I'm doing my hair um, so you know I'll give it a good wash and then I put in a good amount of uh, conditioner because I do wash my hair once a week so when I do condition it I like to really just get it hydrated and get it soaked up um, so I've been using this and I really really love it it smells amazing and it just makes my hair so soft and it's easy to finger comb when I'm in the shower which is something that I definitely do a lot I put in my conditioner I finger comb it through so my hair is like pinned straight and then I wash it out and it works wonders for my hair. When I'm out of the shower, the first thing that I do after I brush my hair is I put in my Moroccan oil, Moroccan treatment um, oil. I put in my Moroccan oil. And this stuff is amazing. It smells good. It's been on the market for a while. A lot of people talk about it. It's like a, a cult favorite. Something that I've been doing lately that has made a huge difference in how I do my hair is I've been taking the Moroccan oil and I used to put it all over my hair. Now, because I only really need this to um, moisturize my ends and just to get them a little bit healthier so when I get out of the shower I will put this on just the ends of my hair so the bottom quarter of my hair and I'll just make sure the ends are really moisturized and you know this product is like all up in my strands so because I wash my hair once or twice a week it tends to get really flat up here because my hair is really heavy so something that I've been using that I love is the big sexy hair root pump this stuff is amazing don't 
pay full price for this. I got mine at like Burlington Co Factory in the little section that has like all the um, all the hair products. You can get it at like Marshalls and TJ Maxx. And don't pay full price for this. So I picked this up and what I do is I get out of the shower, I put in the Moroccan oil on the bottom of my hair and then right up by the crown. So like this area back to this like area back here. I take that mousse, it's a mousse, and I put it in my hair and I just work it in and I zhuzh it up and this gives my hair a lot of texture. It, When it dries, it doesn't dry so flat against my face and not only that, but I noticed that it actually keeps oil out of my hair longer so I it prolongs the time between my washes. My hair is crazy now. It's an amazing product if you struggle with flat hair, no volume, that type of thing, definitely check it out. It's a really good product and yeah, you can get it really well priced at TJ Maxx or Marshalls or any place like that. So that's what I do pretty much every day and when I'm wearing my hair straight or I'm styling my hair curly like this. But if I want to wear my hair naturally curly because I have a very, I have very wavy curly hair, I like to use a Moroccan oil um, hydration cream, hydration styling cream. And this stuff is amazing. So what I'll do is I'll again put this right on the ends just to get you know my roots, not my roots, my ends um, moisturized. And then I go in with this and I use about four to five pumps of this and I just work it all over my head. I brush my hair out so it's pinned straight. Then I take this and I work it into my head and I just, I don't scrunch my hair because I think that messes with your curl a little bit. So I just take it and I comb it through with my fingers all over my head. And then when it's straight, I just pull it back and I let my hair dry naturally. And I think that this cream allows your hair to take its natural curl when it's drying. And I really love the effect of, that my curls get. They're very soft, they're very shiny, they're moisturized, and I love it and it smells amazing. If I'm wearing my hair straight, then of course you need to put in, ooh, of course you need to put in a serum, um, either you know a protectant serum so your hair doesn't get fried or a protective spray. So my favorite is again the Chi 44 Iron Guard. I've been using this for years and I use this if I'm going to be straightening my hair. I put it on the ends and it just helps my hair get in, like a super straight sleek look but it also protects my hair from damage and again you can get this at TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington Co Factory probably has it. Just pick it up from one of those stores. Do not again pay full price for this. You can get a lot of hair stuff like really cheap. I wish you could do that with makeup but you can. So next I'm going to talk about hairspray. I don't really use hairspray to be like perfectly honest but when I do use it I got this Mar uh, Mark Anthony True Professional Oil of Morocco Argan Oil Volumizing Shine Hairspray. Lord have mercy. That's super long. Uh, it's infused with keratin. I mean I didn't even finish. This smells really good. I use it right up here on my roots. I used it in my last video in the Diwali Get Ready With Me if you haven't seen it. You better watch it. I use this, I got it as a sample. It's actually a really good hairspray. Um, I like to kind of collect hairsprays that are in like sample form because I think they're easier to travel with because I don't want to be carrying, I carry so many products when I go traveling and I'll probably do a what's in my travel bag honestly because I have so much stuff but so many hair products. Um, but I like to like hoard and collect these guys so I don't have to put in another bottle into my suitcase. My next product that I love, I talked about this in another video, is dry shampoo. Dry shampoo, dry shampoo, dry shampoo. And so because I don't wash my hair that often I rely on dry shampoo a lot of the time. Even if I'm just using it to give myself like a little root lift. It's so important and my favorite drugstore brand is Tresemme has a really good one. Sorry lies, lies I told, not Tresemme, Garnier. Garnier has a really really good one. Uh, Moroccan oil dry shampoo is my favorite but another one in the drugstore is Batiste. They used to only sell it at Urban Outfitters, now they sell it in drugstores, so definitely check that one out and it works really, really well. And my favorite one that I, it's a little pricey, but like again, I use the Moroccan oil products and I love this shampoo, um, this dry shampoo. It is Moroccan oil dark tones, soft, silky finish dry shampoo. This stuff is really good. It goes on your hair um, a little bit darker. It does dry a little white, but it, it blends in with your natural hair color. So I've been using this a lot and it smells amazing. So next I'm gonna be talking about hair masks and just hydration uh, creams that you can use in your hair to give it like a restorative boost once a week. Uh, my favorite, favorite hair treatment of all time is the Jasmine and Henna Fluff Ease Hair Treatment uh, from Lush Balm. First of all, it smells amazing. I only use about that much on the first go. So it lasts like three or four, three or four um, washes. And it makes your hair, takes away the fluff out of your hair, takes away the frizz. And also it gives a really nice 
like reddish tint I don't know a lot of Indian people do this but um, you can put henna or mendy into your hair and it will give a nice like red tint or tinge to it this also tends to do that um, they say that it doesn't in store but every time I use it my hair comes out a little bit redder and a little bit warmer which is why I love using this stuff so definitely check it out if you don't want your hair to get red or you don't want it to you know lighten up at all they have a really good one that I can't say the name it's like schwan something I will link it down below because I'm going to butcher the name of it and then next something that I've been loving and just like saving the last drop of it before I go buy the full size is the Eva NYC therapy session hair mask I got this as a sample I think in my Ipsy package and it smells so good it works so well like I use it a couple times in the shower um, like once a week I'll do it and it smells so good and it makes my hair so soft and just so luscious and I love it it's amazing and now I got the scent on my hands which I'm not mad about okay next we're gonna be talking about hair tools so hair tools are just as important as the things you put into your hair they make your hair look better they cut down the time that it takes you to do your hair and a lot of them you know help with shine and help with you know frizz ease or taking away the frizz so it's definitely important to invest in good tools I keep all my hair products in this little basket so first off I'm gonna start with my hair dryer this is the Solia Professional Thermal Ionic Dryer. I got this from Balika. It was $100, but I got it um, on sale. So I think I paid around like $70, $65. I know that the Sea-Doo Revolution, I think it's called Sea-Doo Revolution. It's definitely called Sea-Doo, but it's about $200. It's very pricey. It's very small. That's the only pro I would say for the Sea-Doo versus this. It's very small and doesn't weigh as much, but this dryer is amazing. I use it to blow dry my hair, obviously. I don't really use it to diffuse my hair. I don't really use a diffuser but I pair it with this little nozzle that comes with it and it comes with two nozzles I blow dry my hair downwards and it takes away the frizz and it cuts my my hair drying time in half I really love love this dryer so definitely check out the Solia if you have thick hair with the Solia um, I use a ceramic and ion Olivia Garden Ooh, that. oh that's my girl Lindsay so I use this it just helps me get my hair straight pulls out the frizz I really like this brush it's like 20 bucks I don't think you need to buy like, an expensive brush, if I'm just being honest, but this is what I use. You can get really good ones at the drugstore, so don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You. So next I'm going to show you my favorite curling wand. I used this in my last video. This is a Hot Tools one and a half inch barrel with the clasp. This is really nice for those like Lauren Conrad curls, you know, the Lauren Conrad waves I guess that she had. Circa the Hills, which is like old, but whatever. Whenever I watched that show, I was like, how does she get her hair like that? And I can never figure it out. This is how she does it. And I should also say Hot Tools is my favorite brand for curling irons. My favorite curling wand brand is Numi. Numi always has amazing sales, so never pay full price for these things. They are amazing. They work really well. They're really cutely designed. And uh, this is, I think, a one and a half inch barrel. I'm not sure, but I will link it. Let's see. Does it say? Uh, I will link this down below and it's amazing if you want a more uh, cost-effective wand the Con Air U clip I got it at mine at Target it was like super cheap um, this wand is amazing it's been my favorite go-to one uh, for years and I think a lot of people think that wands can only be used if you are wearing your hair if you're like curling your straight hair I have wavy hair and because I don't wash my hair every single day sometimes the waves like get pull not pulled out but you know they get a little loose and so sometimes when I want to you know keep my hair natural I just use this on the front pieces just to breathe some more life into my curls so I use this guy a lot because it has a very small uh, barrel and it allows me to play with the width so it goes from thicker to thin and it allows me to play with the width of my curls and the tightness of them. So definitely don't sleep on the Conair. You can get it at Target and it's really, really great. Last thing I'm going to talk about hair straightener. So I used Chi Ionic hair straightener for a while, probably like four or five years. It worked really well on my hair, but I've never tried a hair straightener that works better on Indian hair than this guy right here. So this is the GHD. You can get it at Folica. It's about $200. Um, again, Folica has a lot of good sales, especially around this time of the year when it gets to, you know, like Thanksgiving, Cyber Monday. Day, holiday deals don't sleep on Folica Folica has all these different brands that carry a lot so definitely don't sleep on it check it out for this time of year that straightener it's a little pricey but I'm telling you it has never no straightener has ever been able to straighten my hair as fast as this, this one does 
never been able to pull out the frizz like this one does and just make my hair shiny and just you know just get the job done it really works I love my GHD I will never trade out my straightener again never say never but like so that's it, that's all the products that I use. These are my tried and trusted, my favorite, favorite brands. I really don't deviate from what I showed you guys in this video. I am really loyal to them because they work on my hair and I definitely am not a believer in you need to change out your hair products every couple of months. I have used these for years. They have never worked better for my hair. They have never failed me and I'm such a big fan of these products. So definitely check them out if you have thick hair like me, thick, coarse, dry, um, color treated. I have like, I do everything to my hair. So definitely check them out and like this video, subscribe down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Let's say that I use all of my hair tools on the highest setting, which probably isn't a good thing, but I do it anyway.